Friday, we're live at the Pace Studio in Austin, Texas. This with Tyler Ramsey, and we're, we're super stoked to have you. Thanks so much for being here. Oh, thank you for having me here. Yeah, we're excited. Uh, yeah, whenever you're ready, just introduce the first song and take it away. Okay, I'm going to play a, this is a song, or it's actually a kind of a, it starts out with an instrumental piece, and then it goes into a song called Firewood that's on the record that I'm putting out on April 5th, so. Uh, the first part of it's called The Darkest Clouds, and I'll see if I can actually play it this morning or whatever. It's not even morning. It feels like morning. Feels like
Forget that spring will come back. Don't forget the sun is gonna rise. And when all the troubled times have passed, please don't forget that you will always be mine. You will always be Sounds great. Thanks so Thanks. much. Thank you. Yeah, so you mentioned you've got a record coming out uh, April 5th for the morning. I'm doing a little yeah, guitar sorry. switch technical. here. No Just worries. Do what you need to do. <laughs> supposed to be behind scenes. Sorry. <laughs> no worries. Um, yeah. Yes, that I had a uh, record coming out April 5th. Yeah. yeah. Fantasy records. Yeah. Uh, so can you tell us a little bit about, I know I know you live in North Carolina. You did some of the writing um for the album there at home. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, the process of putting everything together? Uh, yeah, it kind of, some of it came from touring, like the little pieces, and I always keep little lines down or like melody lines that I document on my phone or, whoops, whatever I can kind of capture uh, when I can. And then uh, if I can get some downtime where I'm just kind of like able to, get grounded that's when normally those pieces kind of come back together and and sometimes they're like magically uh, a song or whatever so that's that's kind of how that worked on this on cool this one too. all right well uh can you tell us a little bit about the second song you're gonna do this second song is uh is called for the morning and it's the that's the name of the album too uh but this was the first song that i wrote that i felt like was uh showing me that there was going to a path to a new record or whatever there's always for me there's always one that's like okay that's that's a good start and now i need you know 10 or 11 other ones yeah. so cool <laughs> so this is this is that one and it was kind of written uh, right around the time my daughter was born actually and now she's almost she's going to be 5 so wow. it started around then so it was kind of like late nights staying up not getting much sleep in 
night I've been blind I've been running I have been gone Show me what's wrong Morning light Where are you headed to, lonesome? Hiding out in the dark from something bad that you've done. But the past is a specter that you cannot outrun. It'll track you till the ends of the night. There's never been one could hold on to you and there was never a road you could keep the wheels to and all of these things that you never saw through let them go they're just a waste of your time morning light heal my Wait for the morning, my lonely one Wait for the morning light silver Wait for the morning, my lonesome Thank, right, you. thank you so much. These songs sound really great out here. Um, so you've got one more for us, I think. Yeah, I'll do one more song. Can you tell us a little bit about the, the third song you're going to do. This one is a song that's also on my new record that's coming out, <laughs> playing a bunch of new newer stuff. And uh, this is... Uh, this one's called A Dream of Home, and it's just kind of a... I don't know, it's kind of about balancing this life of touring and playing music and having a home life and all that stuff. The thing that we all need to do when we're working all the time. So. I'm a terrible harmonica player too, by the way. So prepare yourself. <laughs> Last time I used this thing, I didn't tighten it enough, and I just kept it just kept going farther and farther down. Oh, no. And the last time I reached for it, I just couldn't even get it. So. <laughs> All right. Except for all the things I told you were worth holding on to All the fields were rolling by And you could watch 
much again for coming and doing this oh and man thanks yeah for the morning out april 5th on uh, uh yeah thanks again for coming we were really stoked to have you here awesome thank you guys so much got a good crew thanks for